You know, I don't want anyone thinking I'm a partisan hack because I'm fucking not, all right? You know, I know it might seem sometimes like I'm some kind of hardcore Democrat because I'm always ragging on the Republicans, but let me just say, the Democrats are no fucking prize, all right? They're just fucking not. You know, all that SOPA and PIPA shit we were fighting against a month ago, that was mostly fucking Democrats bending over for the entertainment industry. You know, when I feel that urge, deep within my wallet to make a new video. I, I, I do my research and I think to myself every time, you know, today I'm going to take on the liberals. I'm going to go after one of these monolithic liberal or progressive ideas just to show that I'm not just some fucking ideologue. But every fucking time, without fail, something that a Republican celebrity or politician has said or fucking done catches my eye and makes it absolutely fucking impossible to talk about anything else. You know, like just the other day, I was thinking I'm gonna make a video and then I see this, oh, Ted Nugent. Fucking irrelevant ass Ted Nugent, an admitted draft dodger, an admitted fucking, you know, fucker of teenage girls. He has said at an NRA rally of all things that if Obama is reelected, he, Ted Nugent, will wind up either dead or in jail, implying that he is going to attempt to assassinate the fucking president. Aging sub fucking standard rock star assassinates leader of free world is not a headline you're gonna fucking see anytime soon so Ted Nugent being dead or in jail that's wonderful but I didn't make the video about Ted Nugent cuz who fucking cares about Ted Nugent not me not you not fucking anybody but then I saw today Eric Cantor the fucking Republican House Majority fucking leader said this shit in his fucking blog. I'm gonna read it to you. We also know that 45% of the people in this country don't pay income taxes at all, and we have to question whether that's fair. Okay, well, first of all, they don't have to pay federal income taxes at all. And I wonder why that is. I wonder why 45% of the population doesn't have to pay federal income taxes at all. Hmm, hmm, hmm. It's because they don't have enough fucking money, you asshole. They ain't got no fucking money. They're broke. They're poor. They don't have enough fucking money to pay federal income tax. We have a progressive tax rate and they don't fucking qualify. They don't qualify to pay into the system because they don't make enough fucking money. You know, there are people in this fucking world, like living in New York City, that pay more for the rent on their penthouse apartment than most families in America make in a fucking year. There are people living in fucking Beverly Hills, California, and fucking other richy fucking places all across the country that live in houses that you couldn't afford if you worked every day for fucking ten years. You couldn't afford that shit. And instead of taking a little bit more money from them, Eric Cantor says, no, nah, we gotta take more money from you, everyday fucking American. You know, it's like saying, don't fill your bucket down there at the river. No, instead, wait outside and cut raindrops in half and use that. You know, does that make any fucking sense to anyone? Does that make any sense to you? It doesn't make any sense to me. How does it make any sense to Eric fucking Cantor? I don't know. Ah! Are these Republicans even trying to be a viable fucking alternative to Democrats? Like, how is anyone voting for these fucking people? Who is voting for them? What motherfucker is sitting around in his fucking house right now going, man, I'm gonna vote Republican because I always vote Republican. Like, Republicans fucking hate you. They spit on you. They fucking think that you're a piece of shit. And you're like, well, I don't care. I'm still voting for them. Better than getting one of them Democrats in there. They might give rights to the gays. Fuck you. You fucking, ah, I can't fucking take this shit anymore. This fucking country is so fucked up. And no one is just like, woo! And anyone who gets like me, anyone who, who, who fucking shows like the least bit of passion, it's like, oh, whoa, man, calm the fuck down. It's just politics. It's just bullshit. It, yeah, it is bullshit. It's a big fucking pageant where uh, on one side you got a bunch of fucking Democrats who at best are spineless fucking cowards and at worst are complicit in the system and just liars. And then you got the Republicans who are just like, hey, we're evil. Vote for us. 
And, and, and I'm just supposed to be like, ha ha, well, you know, that's just Washington. That's just what they're going to do. I'm just going to sit here and play my Xbox and drink my Red Bull fucking energy drink. And everything will be fine. Everything's not going to be fucking fine. It's not. Do something. Do something quickly. Save yourselves. Make some effort to save yourselves. No? Well, then what fucking good are you?